It's the day before Star Wars, the last GD opens, and she's in full promo mode. Laura Dern wore three beautiful outfits as she put in four appearances early on Thursday morning in New York one day after receiving a Screen Actors Guild nomination for her role in Big Little Lies. The talented actress, 50, who plays Vice Admiral Amelin Holdo in the epic space adventure, wore a glamorous, pale pink pantsuit for her chat on ABC's Good Morning America. Laura was joined by her droid BB-8 on GMA and she posted a cute video clip on Instagram of her giving it a pep talk before they went on stage. She captioned it. Helping my little guy get psyched up for live TV. The star went to reveal to the host panel that she was very emotional during her first moments on set. It was odd because Rianne Johnson makes such a protective, amazing environment as a director, she dished. So you walk on set. We've been rehearsing, I'm in my costume, and I'm there to do another day on a movie, and the camera starts rolling, and I open my eyes and I saw C-3PO, and I started crying. I kind of blew my first take because I was so emotional. It is amazing. Laura later rocked a sheer black roll neck top and an eye-catching rotted leather skirt trimmed with studs and black suede over the knee boots. She wore the sizzling ensemble for her interview on the morning mashup on Sirius XM Hits 1 channel and live with Kelly and Ryan. She later posted another video of herself backstage at Kelly and Ryan, saying, so happy to be here and giving shout outs to Roderick and shoe designer Jimmy Choo among others. Busy day, she was later seen in a third outfit as she attended the 38th Annual Muse Awards at New York Hilton Midtown on Wednesday morning, Laura and her Big Little Lies co-stars Reese Witherspoon and Nicole Kidman were all nominated for the prestigious Outstanding Performance by a Female Actor in a Television Movie or Limited Series SAG. Completing the sweep, co-star Alexander Skarsgård received a nod for Best Actor in the Male category. Big Little Lies was a big winner at the Emmys in September and scored a host of Golden Globe nominations earlier this week.